Okay, and another interesting shootout. I know I always say that, but this one is interesting. On the left, we've got Nasus VivoBook S15, uh, uh, which has got the Snapdragon X Elite, and it's touted as being the fastest of the um, computers that have a Snapdragon X Elite chip in them. Um, I'll let you look that up and see if I'm right in that or not. Um, 16 gigs of RAM. On the right, we've got a Surface Pro 11 with the Snapdragon X Pro, uh, also 16 gigabytes of RAM. So interesting. I'm expecting the Vivo Book to, to win this shootout, but by how much, I don't know. Um, and it's going to be interesting to see um, what the processing percentages are um, versus um, other laptops as well. But we'll get to that. Um, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> we'll get to that later on. OK, uh, so the first readout I'll give you will be percentage of processing power for the ASUS VivoBook, and the second one will be the, the same, percentage of processing power for the Surface Laptop, Surface Pro, rather, 11. Um, I should add that both of these are going to be emulating the x86 platform because there isn't a, an ARM version of um, FL Studio yet. OK, so without further ado, let's get stuck in, see how we get on. So out of the doors, we've got 13 versus 12. So the Surface Pro 11 saying it doesn't have to work quite as hard. Out of the blocks, we're now looking at 15% versus 14%. So again, the Surface Pro saying it doesn't have to use as much processing power at this point in time. 15% um, still versus still 14%. So no change there. Um, we normally see a change when we kick into the uh, faster segment of the music, which um, comes up a little bit later. But there's normally a little bit more change in this. They're pretty much even Stevens at the moment. 14% versus on oh, 15%, 14%. It's jumping around. They're both on 14% as I'm speaking now. Uh, so even Stevens at this point. Um, not unusual because at this stage um, we're not having to use an awful lot of processing power. I should just flick on. I don't think it's going to make too much difference on the screen refreshing, but it's always nice to see that point to move. So we're getting into the faster section now. We're looking at 22% versus 21%. 22% uh, versus 21%. 21% versus 21%. So still even Stevens. And they kicked off now. 26% versus 26%. 27% versus 27%. 28% versus 27%. Very interesting. 27% uh, versus 27%. Now, um, I think we're looking at even Stevens, and I, I suspect that it's because the part of the Snapdragon X chip that does the emulation is probably expect exactly the same as far as these two machines are concerned. So um, they should be running pretty much even Stevens. 28% uh, versus 26% there. 30% versus 29%. The Surface Pro um, 11 actually just marginally ahead, I'd say, having to use slightly less processing power. Uh, but as I say, very little in it. 28% versus 26%. I was expecting the uh, Asus VivoBook S15 to be ahead um, by virtue of having the Snapdragon X Elite. But obviously, in this particular test, it makes no difference. And I suspect, with that being a system on a chip, the part of the system that is doing the simulation is exactly the same. Um, I don't know that for definite, but that would be my guess. 28% now versus 28%, so even Stevens. Let's call it a day there. Hope you've enjoyed that. If you have, give it a like. If you want to see more videos like this, then please subscribe. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.